Got his third ring of his NBA yeah. career with the Lakers last, well, just a couple of months ago. Last season, it was obviously October just wrapped up, and the Timberwolves get the first points of this game courtesy of D'Angelo Russell. Not a good decision by Larry Nance to make that pass to Drummond. Just shoot the floater yourself. You're right in front of the rim. Russell off the glass. No, Nance with the rebound. You've got to get out to them. Okogie out to Beasley. Time winding down. Davis didn't get it away in time. It'll be a shot clock violation on Minnesota. Davis right back to Russell. Russell from the elbow leaves it short. The back tap though right into the hands of Edwards. Davis right back to Russell. Russell from the elbow leaves it short. The back tap though right into the hands of Edwards. Lead at the Garden against the Knicks. They held the Knicks to three points in the first almost six minutes of their game and then ended up giving up a huge second quarter and losing the game handily in New York their last time out. To, to, to get scored on in a free throw situation in a fast break fashion is just not acceptable. Russell leaves it short, but right into the hands of Okogie, and Josh is going to go back to the free throw line again. Jared Allen, by the way, he, he's no picnic either in terms of his pick and roll abilities. Russell was trying to get a whistle, I think. Did not get the benefit of the call. Malik gets into the paint. Russell is open. D'Lo three ball, no. And Sexton with a rebound. Yeah, they immigrated to the U.S. from Nigeria. Drummond yet another rebound. That's nine. He's going to get his double-double in this first half. 12 points, nine rebounds for Drummond. Eight-nothing run yeah, by the Cleveland. Isaac, the Isaac Okoro left corner three. He's got to shoot. Cavs shoot forced that. the turnover. Sexton splits between the defenders yeah. and finishes. That was uh, pretty outstanding to, to, to get back like that. Russell, the quick three. Yeah. I thought maybe the Wolves might milk a little more clock to set up the two-for-one. Not closing out long to perimeter jump shooters that are not willing to take threes and giving up too many drives. You can cut that down. Russell with the three-point attempt. The five three-point attempts by the Cavaliers marked the fewest and a half in an NBA game this season. Yeah, well, think about it. one of five. When is the last time you saw that? Colin Sexton here taking D'Angelo Russell off the dribble. Timberwolves are grateful he was unable to connect. Russell, three ball over Nance. That was pretty, and the Timberwolves are back in front. Made them pass it out, but the swing swing that time to Jetty Osman was right on time. And now the Cavs take yeah. it away, and numbers for Cleveland. Okoro with the dunk. Damian Prince has oh, it blocked block. away. Russell, Osman catches up to the play and is able to force a miss. Daniels, who's able to force a miss. Russell again out in front. This time he'll pull up from three. <laughs> Timberwolves haven't given up any points since the 10-15 mark, and it continues seven straight just, possessions now for just, the Cavs without points. You're killing yourself. D'Angelo Russell and Ricky Rubio have missed all these opportunities, so finally knocks one down here. Good job by Garland to get over that screen. D'Angelo Russell doesn't get called for a foul there, but knocks down the triple. When you got the big just backing you down and backing you down, and, and, and the cavalry's not coming. Russell, yes! Timberwolves putting the pedal to the metal here in the fourth quarter. Final two minutes. Russell and the Wolves not in a hurry. Shot clock, though, is down to three. Russell gets it away, cannot connect. Against Andre Drummond, too, just one of eight here in the second half, Dave. He's done most of his damage from the free throw line, not from the field. Russell. Nance pulls down a rebound. 